Hello and welcome to this new video tutorial of WordPress WooCommerce Marketplace Buyer Seller Chat Plugin. And in today's video tutorial, we'll be showing you how the WooCommerce Marketplace customers would be able to chat with the uh, respective sellers uh, whose uh, uh, product the uh, customer is going to uh, purchase from the storefront. So the customer just needs to navigate to a particular product, and for that product, uh, the uh, customer would be able to directly chat with that particular product seller so uh, the customers will have this option on the product pages itself and the seller would also be able to do the same from his uh, own account panel and he can basically reply back to the customers for the queries that the customers have raised for his particular products within the woocommerce marketplace itself so basically uh, before we proceed further to the web store front end uh, we will be showing you the uh, workflow at the customer's end. Thereafter, we'll be showing you the backend configuration that is basically required for making use of the WordPress Marketplace Buyer Seller Chat plugin within your store. So uh, before that, let me give you a small gist about this uh, plugin itself. So basically, it uh, brings in the communication element within your WooCommerce store that would allow uh, your WooCommerce Web Store customers to directly chat with the respective product seller the customer can easily start a chat with the respective seller and can ask for the related information or queries directly from the seller itself and the seller would also be able to respond directly to the customer's query as required apart from that some highlighted features of this particular plugin are it provides uh, features for example like multiple chat support is there chat notifications are there you can make use of smiley or emoticons as well and apart from that you can see the uh, the seller basically can see the buyer list and uh, the sellers as well as the customers would be able to set their status as online busy and away so uh, let's get ahead and let's see how this uh, particular plugin works at the front end uh, and we'll be showing you the workflow at the customer end now so right now I'm at the uh, WooCommerce Marketplace web store uh, front end as you can see right now and uh, from here the customer just needs to log into his account so as to uh, set the uh, option or en enable the option of chatting with the uh, sellers for their products. So I'll be uh, logging into my customer account by entering my username and password here. So I'll just enter the username and password and I'll tap on the login button. So I've logged into my account as you can see on the right hand side I have my uh, account op options as you can see. So uh, now uh, the customer would be able to chat with the particular sellers and for that what I'll do is I'll go to the uh, shop page where all of the products are being uh, uh, listed out. So here I'm at the shop page and you can see that we have a lot of products here. So let's go to this hoodie uh, product. Uh, that's on sale right now and for $42 so I'll just tap on that so right now we are on the uh, product page itself and uh, you can see that uh, at the bottom right hand corner we have this option that says chat with us so as soon as the customer logs into his uh, account and navigates to any of the product pages the customer would be able to see this particular chat with us uh, uh, chat box and from here the customer can basically uh, directly can ask the uh, different questions or queries regarding this particular product so uh, uh, for example if the customer is on any of the products within the marketplace store and uh, when he comes to that particular product uh, and for that product that the seller that is uh, actually uh, uh, selling out those uh, products this uh, chat would enable the customer to directly interact with him itself so uh, let's tap on that and this brings up this uh, chat window as you can see and from the top we can minimize it and can close it down as well apart from that you can see that uh, right now uh, we are online and we are having this green indicator here and from the drop down here we can change our status as well so for example right now it's online we can set it as busy as well as you can see the status has changed to busy and you can also set it as offline as per your requirement there and from here the customer would be able to send uh, the uh, queries or can ask any questions to the uh, seller directly 
So for example, if I type in help me with the product quantity, all right, and let's tap the enter button. So uh, I've just got the uh, spelling mistake there. So just uh, ignore that up. So I've just sent out the uh, particular message to this uh, product seller directly from this chat window. And uh, now uh, uh, the seller will receive this particular message and can then reply back to this particular uh, particular customer from his uh, chat option within within his own account panel. And uh, apart from uh, uh, messaging the uh, uh, respective seller the customer would also be as I've already told you can change his uh, online status apart from that the customer can also check the history logs by tapping here on the clock icon and then he can choose uh, to display the messages like last 24 hours like last seven days last 30 days or whether you want to check all of the message uh, uh, history then you can tap on forever option Apart from that, uh, the customer can tap here on the configuration icon to change the profile settings. Let me tap on that. And from here, the customer can basically change his uh, profile icon and can change his uh, first name. Let's set it as Peter W and the last name as well. Thereafter, he just needs to tap on the save button. And you can see uh, updated successfully uh, message at the top as well and uh, if we tap on here and tap the uh, settings one again so here you can see that the name has uh, actually changed and uh, apart from that the customer can also send uh, the emoticons uh, and uh, for that let me uh, give you an uh, option here so actually the screen was not visible there basically so from here you can tap on this uh, icon here and that brings the emoticons and according to them you can choose any of the emoticons and can send uh, those emoticons to the uh, seller itself so for example i've uh, sent an ok hand and an other emoticon as well so uh, basically that's how the customer would be able to access the uh, chat option with uh, the sellers and this is a direct option because uh, it allows the customers and the sellers to uh, chat with each other in the real time so uh, this was how the customers can do it now let me log out of this uh, customer account so for that I'll just go to my account and then under my account panel I'll just tap on the log out button now let me show you if a guest customer comes in how he can do the same so for that he'll have to log in and uh, for that let me go again to the shop page so here I'm at the shop page uh, let me tap here on the hoodie itself the uh, product and we'll uh, be checking the option of chat on the product page itself so here we are on the uh, product page right now so uh, if a customer comes in and he is on the product page he'll still see this chat window if he taps on that he can see the option to enter the username or the email address and the password and then he can tap the login button to log into uh, his account and thereby start charging, chatting with the respective seller itself. So the guest, guest customer must have uh, himself registered uh, before he can make use of his username and the password to log into the chat window here. So that was the customer friend and uh, now let me go ahead and let me show you the seller's uh, end and we'll see the seller's workflow for the same. So for that, I'll just take you to the login page first. So here I'm at the uh, login page uh, for the marketplace uh, buyer seller chat plugin. And on the left hand side, I have the vendor details already entered. I'll tap on the login button now to access the seller account. So I've logged into my seller account. As you can see right now, we are on the dashboard and on the left hand side, we have the marketplace uh, block. Uh, with the different options for the marketplace itself and on the right hand side here you can see uh, here we are able to see this particular icon just tap that up and that brings out the uh, chat window for the seller and here you can see uh, that we have the last uh, customer here as Peter W and Do W so uh, let's tap on that so because right now I've uh, logged out of the customer uh, account there so right now that's why Peter W is uh, having this gray uh, shade 
uh, status that means he is not available right now and here you can see that uh, the now the seller would be able to see the same message that the uh, customer has sent him out uh, from the product page itself and you can also see the emoticons that the uh, uh, customer sent out then uh, the seller can just uh, reply back to the customer uh, I can assist and can tap the intern enter button there and here you can see that uh, now the seller has responded to this particular customer and that's how uh, the uh, seller would be able to reach back to the customer apart from that we can tap here or the seller can tap here on the icon of, uh, that looks like a clock and you can filter out or display basically the last 24 hours messages or last seven days last 30 days or whether you want to display all of the messages forever and this would uh, display all of the messages that have uh, initiated between the customer and the uh, seller itself apart from that the uh, seller would be able to chat with multiple customers at the same time so for example if I tap here on uh, Ryan Goss the window will open up John Dory the window comes up John Parker so here we can see that the seller can directly uh, chat at the same time or simultaneously with multiple customers so uh, all right let me give you an example for how we can check uh, the messages so I'll click uh, on the uh, clock icon here first and thereafter I'll be tapping on the forever right now you can see that uh, I am not able to scroll within this chat window and we are only having three uh, messages two from the customer and one uh, from the seller itself so uh, now you can see that I'll be able to scroll through the messages that have uh, been sent out and received between the seller and the customer and for that I had uh, chosen forever so that's how basically the uh, sellers would be able to reply back to the customers from their account panel itself and they can uh, chat with the multiple uh, customers at the same time and similarly the uh, sellers would also be able to uh, change their status as online busy or offline they can also edit their profile settings can change their uh, icon or the profile icon and can also change their first and last name so that was the seller's end now let's go to the back end and let's see what different configuration settings are for this particular plugin for use so here I'm at the uh, backend panel for the WooCommerce Marketplace uh, plugin here uh, for the chat and I'll just tap on the login button. So you can see that I've logged into my backend uh, panel right now and on the left hand uh, side panel we have this option buyer seller chat as you can see and we are having two sub menu options within that one is for chart history and the other one is for configuration. Let me open them one by one so we'll first go to the configuration section and then we'll be checking the uh, chart history so here we are on the uh, configuration settings as uh, you can see right now and uh, for more information you can check the user guide that i've uh, attached within the description section below to understand completely how we can do the configuration settings for this particular buyer seller chart plugin so basically here you can basically to use this stop button to stop the interaction and can also start to connect with the uh, server itself apart from that you can set up the host name the port number the chat name so this chat name uh, gets visible on the chat window itself as I've already shown you at the front end and apart from that you'll be able to uh, uh, customize your chat window as well so you can uh, customize the receiver chat time text color receiver chat background color uh, you can change the text color you just need to tap on the select color and choose the color that you want for the uh, receiver text color then you can set up the seller chart st strip color and uh, similarly you can set up also the uh, sender chart time text color and the rest of the uh, configuration settings uh, for the customization of your chat window lastly you can also choose uh, HTTPS enabled if uh, your website is there so you can use an SSL secure socket layer for security if you choose this as yes then you need to upload the server private key server certificate key and the server CA bundle file so these three files are required for this particular plugin to work if you're using it uh, 
along with the HTTPS and these three files you'll be able to get from your host provider and the file extension must be .key and uh, if you're uh, having your own uh, hosting then there's no issue otherwise if you're using a shared hosting then you must uh, ask uh, your uh, admin to provide you with the same so uh, that was basically the configuration settings for the biocellular chart now let's go to the chart history section so here the admin uh, can basically check the uh, chart list so for that he just needs to choose the uh, seller from the seller list from the drop down here and thereafter the admin will choose the respective uh, buyer from the buyer list so he will be choosing peter doe and we can tap on the see chat button to chat the to check the chat history between the seller john doe and the customer peter doe and that brings up the chat history as you can see so this was the last message as a seller that i sent out to the customer and peter doe as a peter doe customer i had sent out the emoticons and uh, helped me with the product quantity so that's how the uh, admin can see the chat between the seller and the buyers from the admin backend panel as well so uh, that was much about the uh, wordpress uh, woocommerce marketplace buyer seller chat plugin and i hope it helped you out and if you still facing any issues or have any queries then you can always get back to us at support at the of webcool.com or you may raise a ticket at webcool.uedes.com thanks for watching this video and have a great day ahead